We have a whole lot of new products that we're launching here and throughout the year. So one of the things that we launched is a new column. It's called a Glycan Pack AXR1 column that's really designed to do high resolution separation of glycans. It separates based on charge state. Within each charge state, it separates based on size, polarity, as well as isomeric structures. So what it does now is provide us a way to do a high throughput, large scale separation of glycans. Because now we are separating so many glycans, we really need very fast mass spectrometers to go after these glycans and characterize them. And the Orbitrap Fusion provides that advantage because of the faster scan speed and the high resolution, which allows us to really not only characterize the abundant glycans, but the low abundant glycans as well. Uh, customers are loving it because they can now really look in depth what are all potential glycans that are present. So with a lot of the existing columns, they only show maybe few separated peaks. So within each separated peaks, there are tons of structural isomers present. But with this particular column, because we are separating all these structural isomers, they are really seeing what is truly present in that sample and not just a fraction of that representation. So another thing that we have for glycans now is the ability to do quantitation. So we've extended our tandem mass tag families to include glycans. So these are carbonyl reactive tandem mass tags that label a glycan at the reducing end. So we call these our amino oxy TMTs. So we offer a sixplex kit that allows you to quantitate as many as six different samples in a single analysis. Besides being able to look at six samples in a single shot, um, this also improves ionization efficiency of the glycan. So compared to a native glycan, we're seeing anywhere from 20 to 30 fold improvement in ionization efficiency. So this is pretty huge and this is pretty revolutionary because for the first time, you have a commercial product that allows you to do quantitation, very similar to what proteomics is doing. So I think glycomics is really moving into the realm of proteomics now. That is that in the sense that it's accessible to everybody at large now. You can learn more about this column on www.planetorbitrap.com.